Governor Tony Evers made a statewide plea earlier tonight after a projection shows Wisconsin's COVID-19 death toll could more than double to 5,000 by January 1st. Today, Evers signed an executive order advising people to stay home as much as possible to slow the spread of the virus. He said positive cases are climbing at a rate not seen since the outbreak in New York City at the beginning of the pandemic. In March, state health officials had estimated that the Safer at Home executive order would have saved between 300 and 1400 lives, an order that ha was struck down by the state Supreme Court in May. And then as of today, nearly 2400 people have died in our state. Ever says the crisis is urgent for our livelihoods and Wisconsin's economy. I'm concerned about what our current trajectory means for Wisconsin's health care workers, families and our economy if we don't get this virus under control. So I want to be clear tonight. Each day this virus goes unchecked is a setback for our economic recovery. Our bars, restaurants, small businesses, families and farmers will continue to suffer if we don't take action right now. Our economy cannot bounce back until we contain this virus. Evers says in the coming days he will be announcing a COVID-19 relief package to make sure resources are available where needed. He says he expects it to pass quickly.